Serious question. How many of you actually watch YouTube videos in 4K? So why am I talking about this? Well, one, I need to make a video, and two, I've sort of changed my approach to how I make my YouTube videos in the first place. It kind of started maybe about seven videos ago from this video's release date. What ended up happening was that I got a new laptop, the Aero 15X, and I picked it up, really great spec, six core laptop, GTX 1070, Max-Q. I upped it to 32 gigs of RAM, I popped in a two terabyte M.2 SSD, and it's just screaming and it's flying, and it's allowing me to edit my videos at a really great rate. But something changed. I was shooting B-roll uh, for a lot of my content, right, my reviews, and I was shooting in slow motion, 60p, 120 frames per second. The problem is, Sony, at this point, doesn't have like a consumer or prosumer DSLM that offers 4K 60p. Well, the current leader right now is Panasonic. They've got the Panasonic GH5 and the S model that shoot at 4K 60p. And well, I'm not gonna dish out almost 10 grand maybe for like a cinema camera that's gonna give me the 4K 60p altogether. I'm kind of in the Canon, I'm kind of in the Sony ecosystem at this point, so I'm gonna pretty much stick with it going forward. So what does this all mean? It's a question I've been asking. Do I really need to shoot my content in 4K? I used to be a big proponent of it. I was all adamant about it, getting more storage, left and right, everything. Get 4K, shoot in 4K, preserve the details. And there's some very good advantages with 4K especially being able to take really nice eight megapixel still grabs depending on how you shoot your footage. Now I'm not saying I'm never going to shoot in 4K ever again. Actually, I still do once in a while depending on a given scenario. However, when I know my content is gonna go to YouTube, I've decided I'm just gonna stick with 1080p for now until Sony releases a camera, wink wink, that does shoot 4K 60p, then maybe just maybe things will change a little bit. So I'll bring the question up again. Do you watch YouTube videos in 4K if the option is there? Do you have a really great phone provider that gives you unlimited 4G LTE without any throttling that ever happens? Because I get throttled after a certain amount of gigabytes. So I'm definitely not looking to watch YouTube videos at 4K anytime soon. So let me know in the comments your situation. Does it matter? Are you shooting in 4K? I'd, I'd really like to know if you're, you're shooting in 4K with your Sony camera or whatever camera, because obviously Canon offers 4K. Whatever camera you're using, are you shooting in 4K? And then what do you do with it? Are you storing it? Are you posting it? And at the end of the day, everything kind of gets downscaled onto a screen like this because most people, if I look at my stats, are watching my videos on a device like this. And most of these don't even have 4K screens, and I don't think it's really gonna matter at all. I know, it's been a weird topic for this discussion. I've just been shooting a lot more with the RX100 Mark V ever since I dropped it. I really will, I really do hope that Sony releases maybe another version of this soon. Maybe it has 4K 60p, maybe a Sony A7000 with 4K 60p, because the current cameras that I own, and I do own quite a few Sony cameras, they all shoot 4K but not at 60 frames per second. And would love to take advantage of that quality eventually, but I'm thinking about it every single day. Does anyone even care about watching anything in 4K at this very moment, especially when it comes to YouTube videos? Because at first I was a little concerned. I really wanted the quality to be good because sometimes I'm trying to show the sharpness of a photo and how it looks. But usually if I punch in and you'll see it in some of my past videos, I go 100% on the image, even if it's on 1080p, you can usually judge for your own eyes the resolution and detail of the photo within the video. So it never was a really big deal or a big problem. So that's it. Let me know in the comments, do you watch 4K YouTube? Are you doing it now? Do you record in 4K or just in 1080p? I'd love to know what you've got to say in the comments below. Folks, that's gonna do it for me in this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, Check out my other content. I'll see you later. Peace.